that's got, you can see here, a fully integrated HVAC system. And it's unique as opposed to a rooftop unit that's sitting proud up on the roof, likely to get damaged if you're off trailing through brush and debris. The actual unit is located just below these seats underneath the floor compartment. So all that weight for the whole HVAC, HVAC system is stored underneath the floor, keeping the center of gravity of this vehicle at an extreme low. Uh, it performs very well. There's a lot of ducting that runs up through the compartments, all insulated, uh, a well-insulated cab, uh, giving you tons of airflow to keep the nice panoramic viewing wide open. And in the summer months, it's the same goes for the air conditioning. So lots of airflow to keep the, the cab cool uh, in the hotter months of the year. So three-speed fans, lots of airflow. We got a lot of glass, you know, with the, the QX4 cab with the panoramic viewing. We wanted to make sure that it stays clear in the winter time. So we've got a ton of airflow with great heat. We actually had to turn down the heat here. I think today it's about 20, 25 degrees out. We were cooking ourselves out of here, so we had to turn the heat down on low on the way out. It's got great heat, lots of output, um, both for, for heat and air conditioning. So in the event that you're in a real humid, even in the cold climate, by running the air compressor for the AC system, it'll pull that extra moisture out of the air. And uh, you can run fresh air or recirculated air. Fresh air typically in the winter time again is better because you're pulling in that drier air from outside, not the humid air from inside the cab. So keeps the windows clean and keeps the cab nice, toasty, and warm for you.